Hey there Capricorn, welcome to your reading for the week of December 28th. This week you start off with the uh, Four Hearts. Great card. I mean, this is a card of moving, traveling, um, traveling to move, uh, traveling for business, uh, getting a new job even, uh, getting a new house, all, all those things. I think I covered that with moving, but all those things come up with that with this card. It's a very positive card. It also is a card that just simply makes you feel good in, in the home. You know, fours represent the home, and the four of hearts can sometimes just represent all the good, positive feelings that we have in our home. So like, you know, comfort, security, all of those things. We could just be feeling that those feelings in general this week, so just feeling very kind of like content and happy and pleased and not really kind of being more um not having to worry so much about everything this week kind of like a nice light week which is nice to see and next you have the jack of hearts really kind of speaks to that as well actually your reading follows a nice little uh progression here that really kind of speaks to that happy-go-lucky kind of thing that i'm feeling this week for you jack of hearts is all about having fun just kind of like having fun being fun not having much to worry about and all that. Uh, it can also represent an admirer, having an admirer, somebody who's interested in you. Um, I always say with the Jack of Hearts, you'd probably know who this person is. It would probably be pretty obvious. I, I say probably because it's not probably true for all of you. But for most of you, Jack of Hearts, they don't really hide it necessarily. Even look at this card. I mean, that guy's like decked out in uniform. He's kind of like on a white horse and he's really standing out. So if you do have an admirer, you would probably have like at least a gut feeling about this person uh, and your feeling would be correct that's what this card says next you uh, this card this deck has uh, four of the major arcana in it and you got the fool card coming up next setting out on a new path I think maybe you've made some decisions over the past couple weeks here and on, on which direction you're going, even though there was probably like a lot of confusion about which direction you were going, quite frankly. Um, but now it's kind of like you're setting out on like a new path and you're just like, okay, I'm making a decision. I'm going this direction. This is what I'm going to do done and now you're setting out on that path and uh, the fool i always it's good you know the the thing you have the jack you have this fool coming up i think one of the things that will benefit you and i think i said this to another sign um maybe in the past but i think the thing that will benefit you is that this new path that you're setting out on it's like you're not an expert um on this path it's like it's kind of like new to you you don't know everything and I, I think that will benefit you I actually think that will be to your advantage you know sometimes uh, when you look at people who are experts in a field they you know they they don't like remember all that stuff that they learned in the beginning you know if that makes sense when they were like they had fresh eyes they were new and fresh in the field so they can make a lot of mistakes and it cannot and uh you know people who are like immature they can make those like rookie moves so to speak that are just like kind of like dumb enough or whatever to i don't know how else to say it but to, to work so it's like you could make some sort of like rookie mistake that actually turns out to be something that really works out for you uh so like you know it's kind of like that um that ignorance is actually going to be your friend this week at, at, at something new, you know? And next you have the, to the tower card in reverse. So you get two major arcana like in a row, which is pretty crazy. But the, the, uh, the tower in reverse is the way you want it to be, really. But it really says that you're going to be avoiding a disaster. You have avoided a disaster, figured out kind of like how to avoid some sort of disaster, which is really great. i um, happy to see this in reverse, like I said. And then next you have the two of clubs. Definitely going to have to face some fears this week uh, in regards to this new path as well. Like I said, it's going to be new. It's going to be fresh. You haven't experienced it in the past. But this card, it just pushes you along. It just kind of says, like, go. Don't turn around. Don't stop. Don't question yourself. Just keep going. And that's where the success will come. It's actually a very successful card um, that brings a lot of success to you if you just keep on you know, keep on trucking, which I think you will this week. So all in all, great week. Thank you for watching. Enjoy.